Hi, welcome to today's episode of The Bold and the Beautiful. We open up at Deacon's and Sheila and Deacon are in bed naked. And then Sheila asks if it is really worth the risk to be there with Deacon. Then we go over to Bill's and we see Bill is at home alone thinking about Liam's words that he said about Sheila and wondering if Sheila is messing with him. So Liam's seed that he planted is working. Then we go over to Hope's and we see Hope update Liam that her line is on pause. However, she isn't, hasn't told him about Thomas as yet. Then we go over to Forrester and we see Brooke and Taylor are in the office discussing Hope, Hope's line being on pause. Taylor then tells Brooke that Thomas is the solution to saving Hope's line and Brooke is not happy to hear it. Liam tries to convince Hope that everything is not falling apart. She just needs time to regroup and bounce back with her line. Back at Deacon, Sheila says that the more time she spends with Bill, she realizes Bill is too emotional and is all over the place. And Sheila says that she wonders where she stands with Bill. It feels like one minute he wants to open up and the next minute he feels like he can't stand her. Back at Forrester, Brooke asks if Hope is considering taking back Thomas and, Leah, and then asks what Liam would say if he if she does take back Thomas. She expressed that Hope wouldn't be thrilled. Taylor then asks Brooke to look past the CPS call and consider Thomas coming back. And then Thomas walks in and Thomas gets to apologize to Brooke and ask for forgiveness and not just for him, but also for Hope's line. Back at Hope's, Hope also is expressing the problem with Douglas and says that every day that passed, Douglas is growing further away from her. Back at Deacon's, Deacon is surprised that Spencer talks about his feelings. He considered him to be a more stronger man. Sheila says that Bill is a man all about the chase until Bill settles and looks for his next high. So Sheila is here thinking that Bill will eventually get over the high that they're on right now and send her back to jail. Sheila then says that if Bill finds out about their Ish, what they're doing then the option going to prison will be much better than bill killing them back at forester thomas tells brooke about his therapy and says what he did was wrong and he never should have done it brooke says he she has heard these apologies from Thomas before, but it cost her her marriage, so she's still upset about it. Brooke says that they will deal with it at a later date and get past it eventually. But how does she trust Thomas with hope again? Back at Hobbs, Hobbs asks Liam what how she is doing, and Liam says he doesn't want to pile on his problems on Hope. But Hope tells him to talk, and he rants about the problem with Bill and Sheila. Then we go over to Bill's, and we see Bill text Sheila asking where she is. Then we go over to Deacon's, and we see Sheila gets the text, and she says that she is not used to answering to anyone. Sheila is worried she could go back to prison. And Deacon laughs about it. Sheila yells at Deacon and tells him to swear that he will never tell Bill and he Bill will find out about them. Back at Forrester, Brooke explains how much Thomas hurt Hope and has betrayed her. Thomas says that he wants to prove to everyone that he is a better person man and taylor tries to humanize thomas to brooke and brooke demands that thomas fixation and hope has got to be stopped back at hopes hope is worried about bill and liam says that he thinks that sheila should be the one worried about bill and not the other way around then we go back to Bill's and we see Sheila returns home and Bill asks where has she been and she says she was shopping but she buys nothing. Sheila asks why is Bill looking at her like that and he says Leah mentioned something to him, something that he should not trust her and Bill reminds Sheila that nobody betrays him 
and get away with it. Thanks for watching. Bye.